Hello everyone, welcome to a Civil Mania. So in today's lecture, I will be teaching you about Trust 101. That is basically a new software specially used for the analysis of trusses. So hope you can see here. So these are the various struct, um, softwares of civil engineering which I will be going to use in my further videos to teach all this kind of softwares so stay tuned to my channel for the upcoming lectures so in today's lecture I will be telling about Trust 101 so it's a basically a new software so let me open Trust 101 hope you can see here this is the trust 101 and this is the software which is used to analyze various kind of uh, trusses as well as frames so let me do one thing let me first of all click here after opening trust 101 uh, click it here new then you can select the unit whether i will you will be uh, doing the project in the empirical unit or in the metric unit suppose let me select metric unit and uh, all these are the nodal displacements bar forces and length in meter okay so i'll uh, press okay after that here x axis and y axis will be present now i have to like update how many number of nodes are required suppose i need to draw a one type of truss uh, of uh, let me suppose five nodes are there five nodes and update it after that our always first coordinate will be zero zero so here zero and here zero so this one will be the first coordinate okay along with the support afterwards you can also even change the type of supports and all these things so let me assign the second point at a distance of four meter suppose uh, sorry suppose uh, let me give us eight meter eight meter and zero meter this is the second point then third point at two meter and four meter so this is the third point and fourth point at 10 meter sorry 10 meter and 4 meter so this is the fourth point and let me delete do one thing so try as only with the four node so these are the four nodes okay after providing all the four nodes now let me go to the members after going to the members there will be how many members suppose let me provide five members update so first member is from one to two so provide here one and provide here two two enter press enter this is the first member then one two three another member will be there then three to four three to four another member then two to four another member so so this is the full structure now suppose let me provide another member from three to two S always remember that you can either here two to three or three to two it doesn't matter only you need to join the proper members from the node to node right here three to two so this one will be joined so this is the full structure which i need to analyze after that let me provide load uh, let me change the supports so here there are two support let me provide one as uh, horizontal roller i can provide here okay so in this manner you can provide different different type of support you can also provide the horizontal roller pinned okay vertical roller suppose you need to provide here load so click on load you need to provide load at node number three and node number four 
अपडेट इट एंड नोट नंबर फोर मैग्नीट्यूड ऑफ फिफ्टी किलो न्यूटन एट एन एंगल ऑफ सपोज आई विल बी प्रोवाइडिंग एट एन एंगल ऑफ नाइन्टी डिग्री देन इट विल बी इन दी अपर डायरेक्शन लेट मी प्रोवाइड हेयर मैग्नीट्यूड ऑफ हंड्रेड एट एन एंगल ऑफ माइनस नाइन्टी देन इट विल बी इन द डाउनवर्ड डायरेक्शन ओके सो आई सो नाउ आई नीड टू एनालाइज द ट्रस सो फॉर दैट सिंपली आई नीड टू क्लिक इन ऑल दिस थ्री थिंग्स इज वन इज द इन्फ्लुएंस लाइन इवन बाय द हेल्प ऑफ दिस सॉफ्टवेयर यू कैन फाइंड आउट द इन्फ्लुएंस लाइन डायग्राम एज वेल एज मेम्बर फोर्सेज लेट मी सपोज क्लिक इन दिस फोर्सेस आफ्टर क्लिकिंग इन दिस फोर्सेस इट विल show you all the member forces in all the members of the truss and along with that it will show you whether it is compression or tension you can uh, check here these are compressive tension tension compressive compressive is always in the negative and tensile is always positive in the trusses after that you can also even go to the properties and you can Uh, provide the modulus of elasticity as here modulus of elasticity is 2900 here you can see here giga pascal unit of e and area is mm square you can also even update this properties as per strength of material so if you want any other property you can update here okay but i have kept all these properties as default i i will show you simply how to calculate the member forces as you can see here how to calculate the member forces now let me go to the displacements suppose let me check where the displacement occur see as you can see here the node number 3 is displaced by 9.7423 in the upward direction and For node number four is displaced in the downward direction of thirty two point seven eight eight mm. These are all are in mm because I have already set the units in my first step itself. Now I can even check the animation of the full truss. So let me click in this animation. As you can see here, how does how the truss has been displaced in the point node number three as well as in the node number four. okay so he even in node number 2 there is displacement in the x direction but in this 3 and 4 there is displacement in both x direction as well as y direction here also x direction as well as y direction but in node number 2 there is only displacement in the x direction because roller support is present here so it rolls towards the pinned support but in this node number 1 there is no displacement at all neither in x direction nor in y direction so this is how we can solve the trusses it can be of any kind of trusses simply we can solve any kind of trusses by the help of this truss 101 software so let me stop it now even i can find out the influence line diagram suppose uh, let me provide the uh, starting point as the 1 and uh, ending point as the 2 that calculate the influence line diagram so this is the influence line diagram then suppose starting point is 1 and ending point is 4 then calculate the influence line diagram so this is the influence line diagram suppose starting point is 2 and ending point is 4 calculate the influence line diagram this is the influence line diagram so in this manner we can calculate for each and every members as the influence line diagram with the values okay so influence line is always the, for the unit load so actually this is the influence line diagram for the reactions but not for the shear force as well as bending moment okay so even you can go to the report and you can uh, check for the but suppose you can write here the truss or user name as uh, truss and project or here also you can provide as truss so you can generate the report after and you can save here the report in the documents file or anywhere you can save here so this is what the report has been generated so now you can open the report after going to the downloads file documents file and you can
so this is the report which is opening right now so trust analysis report okay trust 101 software you can see here each and every node number says the reactions these are the various reactions point to point okay even you can check for the member stiffness matrices stiffness matrices you can check here so even the global stiffness matrices local as well as global both they will show you then the force matrices then the member forces and support reactions the nodal displacements then the influence line diagram for each and every node see so this is how we can import the report and we can also create the report so i hope it's clear to all of you that how to do the analysis of the trust by using the trust 101 software and remember that this software is very very important especially for the students and uh, uh, for the working person says those who are uh, actually those who are doing the analysis of the trusses in their day-to-day -day life even while the time of uh, teaching uh, or uh, doing doing btec in civil engineering uh, we come across as various subjects like strength of material structure and analysis there we come across the analysis of trusses by using method of joints method of sections or even geometric methods okay so you can simply find out the results by using this software okay so hope it's clear to all of you uh, how to solve it so if you like the video then please uh, press the like button and uh, thanks for watching my video have a good day take care